let your righteousness come. We proclaim the kingdom. We proclaim the kingdom. Come. Come. We proclaim the kingdom. We proclaim the kingdom. Come now, 
life has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. I want you to, to, to receive this today. This is your commissioning today. See, the glory of the Lord is risen upon you, upon you, upon you. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth, and deep darkness the people. Right now, there's a lot of darkness in this city. There's a lot of yeah. darkness in the world. We shouldn't be surprised by that. Since deep darkness are going to be over the, cover the earth, and, this, and darkness shall cover the people. But the Lord but. will arise over you. And his glory, his his glory. glory will be seen upon you. Yeah. The Gentiles shall come to your light. The kings to the brightness of your rising, lifting up your eyes all around this and to see. They all gather together. They come to you. Your sons come from afar, and your daughters shall be nursed at your side. And then you shall see and become radiant. Can you see yourself? shall be radiant, and your heart will swell with joy, because of the abundance of the sea shall turn to you, the wealth of the Gentiles shall come to you. As we are praying that this morning, uh, what God was showing, showing me was that, I've read this many times, prayed it many times, but this time God was showing me the fact that that he chooses to have his glory shine yeah. through us. Yeah. Our only job is to reflect his glory. Yeah. So Let it, was shine. Like, it was like he was shining us up. We had like uh, armors of brass on or something. And and he's cho he's chosen to shine his glory on us. And people will see that glory and be drawn not to us but to him. Yeah. Amen. And and what I what I saw I think often in terms of movies, uh, in Lord of the Rings, and uh, one of the Lord of the Rings, there was Helm's Deep, and it was like this part where it was very dark and the enemy had surrounded them, and uh, they were fighting and fighting and losing. They kept falling back, falling back, and then finally they were like, we're gonna have one last grand attack on the enemy. They realized they were going to probably die. They were grossly outnumbered. But they said, hey, let's go out. Let there be a sound that comes out. So they muster themselves, and they go out just fighting hard. And right as they go into the, the enemy, uh, the one guy remembered that a uh, principal character said that at the dawning of the day, look to the east. And the sun was just starting to come over, and he looks up, You've seen the movie, and then all of a sudden Gandalf comes, uh -huh. and he has all of this army, this mighty army with him. So now the army that was facing at them turned and began facing to this great army that was coming. And they began going down this hill, and this is what I saw, that um, he was carrying this his big staff, and then suddenly light went out. And it's like the light caught the sun, caught the light, and it went out to the enemy. It was like blinding them, yeah. and then they began to defeat the enemy. What I saw God doing is that he was releasing his glory upon us, and it was making a way mm -hmm. through the enemy, through the darkness, and so all that we are doing is just stepping in, Hallelujah. and God is doing the work. Hallelujah. And so I'm excited about what is being released. We prayed about 5.30 this morning over the scripture over us, and I told them I would share it with us, that it's not, if we're not having to muster up, you know, it's not about us. I used to have this idea that, that you know, I had to spiritually rub my feet like we used to do in the winter to get static electricity. You know, it's like I gotta, if I pray a little bit more, fast a little bit more, read a little bit more, then I'll get some spiritual charge and I can go and pray for one person and then, then I got to go do it again. But all of that philosophy is, is resting on me. Right. What God is saying, it's not about me. You're just looking for vessels. Yeah. Right. They're just going to go out, we put our streamers up to heaven, we just make a connection point with heaven, and then we say, Lord, let your kingdom come. Yeah. Yeah.
We're not responsible for the results. We believe for the results. We pray for the results. I'm looking for people to get out of wheelchairs and blind eyes to be open. But until then, I'm just going to keep yeah. putting up the heavens and yeah. saying, Lord, let your kingdom come here. Yeah. Let your kingdom yeah. come here. Yeah. Let your kingdom come here. Right. And so I, I know that we're going to have testimony uh, because of what God is going to do today. It's just too much of a setup. Uh, and so I turn it over to our leaders to take it from here. But uh, thank you for letting me share that. Yeah. Amen. Amen. All right, well, I guess from here, we'll just look to head over to Market Square. Yeah. We want to um, pair up, buddy up, however we want to you know, divide and conquer today, just because some of us, this is new. Yeah. And others, it isn't. I'm thinking that might be helpful. Yeah. Some classy, we can figure it out um, how we want to do that. But before we go over, we always put on our armor. And so if everybody wants to just join me in doing that, you may have already done it this morning, but we'll do it again. So mm -hmm. put on our helmets of salvation, yes. and our breastplates of righteousness, yes, uh, our belts of truth, truth. Yes. our feet fitted with the readiness that yes. comes from the gospel of yes. peace. Yes our swords of the spirit and our shields of faith. Yes, and we God. just thank you, Lord, for equipping us with this armor. That we are putting it on and it is intact and that we are ready yes. to go and be your vessels. Lord, yes, I just Lord. ask that as we go out that there would be a peace upon each heart, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, that we would have a readiness and an eagerness in our hearts to just bring your love, to bring kingdom to earth, Lord. Yes, we just ask for um, our ears to be opened and our eyes to be opened, to be used by you. So here we are. Send us, Lord. Yes, God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. For your glory, your honor, and your praise, Lord. Amen. I'm reminded of um, what, what you were saying earlier, Kendra, about God releasing the heavenly host. So we just we just call upon our heavenly host. Yeah. Yes. Your heavenly host, Lord, in the name of Jesus. So we call down the angels, Lord, to encamp around about those who fear you, Lord. We call on your hand, Lord, because we know, Father, that your hand, Lord, is the hand that moves hearts. Yes. Your hand, Lord, is the hand that tra changes lives. Yeah. So, Father, you have given us power. Mm -hmm. Lord, we walk in that in the name of Jesus, but we know we're not alone. Yes. Jesus. Yeah. 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 So, um, I don't know how we want to divide up, like, how everyone's feeling, like, Pastor Eric, if you have a preference of how we want to divide up even. Yeah, we're going to just walk over, you know, and then uh, it's, it's always good to just at least be paired up with someone. And uh, as some of you were down there, it's just a big open park area, so we're just going to go there. Sometimes we kind of cluster together, sometimes we break off. Um, but yeah, just think through if there's a, if there's like a particular uh, uh, way you want to split up, you can. But I'll be available and others who've done it before, and we can connect with each other. Then we're gonna come back here. Right, yeah. I don't how long do we want to head over for today? I don't know. We usually do an hour. Yeah, we usually do an hour. Um, okay, uh, so what's your time is the last I'm fine. How about one person from my team go with like one person from your team? Like okay. each. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Cool. Yeah, so we'll do we'll be down here for like an hour and then um, then we'll come back here and we just kind of debrief on you know what happened and all of that and so um, so we're we'll planning to be back here for 4.30. 4.30, yeah. 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 yeah, plus your mind. Don't put that box around the 4.30. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ish. Yeah. Ish. That could be a little before, a little after.
And I heard your testimony in church the first time I came there. Okay. About how you were sharing with somebody. I think it was a grocery store. Yeah, yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, just, same thing. Same thing. Open up. Open up. Yeah. I think someone just have to use the bathroom. I ain't got it. There's a little line for me. Oh, so. I got you. Got you. Yeah. 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 If anyone's ready, you guys can deploy. Right, so you guys don't leave some the building. Right, I need to leave one person in that pocket as we deliver the last one. person in the pocket. Do you want to use the restroom? Oh, I'm sorry.